Earlier this year, Theo had fallen into taking party drugs with Valerie for a brief time, and has been seeing a counselor since. Justin is worried that Theo could easily fall back into it given any temptations. Hearing that Theo had a date with Abby, Justin headed to Salt and caught Theo in advance of Abby's arrival, revealing he had something important to tell him. Next week, TV Week reports that Justin relays his concerns to Theo about Abby's dubious past, and it appears to be enough of a deterrent for Theo to cancel the date. Looking forward to spending time with Theo, Abby is shattered when she learns that Justin's interference has seemingly lost her one of the only positive things in her life at the moment. Coupled with her stress over Tim and Eden, this could prove to be the final straw as Abby begins to spiral. Realizing the situation she is in, Abby heads over to Northern District's hospital to find Levi. But in what sounds like a massive lapse in hospital security, she instead manages to find herself in front of an open recess trolley where a supply of morphine is stored. It's less logical and more of a survival instinct, Haley Pindo told TV Week. All she can focus on is the pain she's feeling and needing to relieve it. She's realizing that she'll never escape her past, she'll always be judged. That painful realization drives this unrelenting need for relief, so when she spots the vials of morphine, she sees a way out. Meanwhile, Levi is actually at home, and as he learns that Abby is apparently missing, he drafts in Molly to help him search for her. When Nurse Dana sees Abby in the hospital corridor, clearly in a bad state, she's quick to phone Levi and ask him to get there as soon as possible. Will Levi be able to talk Abby around before she does something she regrets?